SVP gives out his winners for week three of the college football season, including Oregon and Washington as favorites. Last week was as fun a week of sweats as you could possibly have in winners. Three games went to overtime. Could have been even better, I suppose it could have been worse. Either way, it's a pair of plus weeks to start, and the card this week again is lengthy. Florida State, minus 3, 57, at Louisville ET on ESPN, Cardinal Stadium, Louisville, Kentucky Van Pelt's pick, Louisville, plus 3, you know how we feel about Friday night games, lose and go to bed bummed before the Saturday slate. But win it and you're off like a rocket ship, and we have a line that is screaming at us and we are listening. Florida State is laying less than 3 to Louisville, huh? Well, we will buy it to 3 and take Louisville at home. SVP, 2 to 1 all time picking Louisville 6 Oklahoma, minus 11, 66, at Nebraska ET, Memorial Stadium, Lincoln, Nebraska Van Pelt's pick, Nebraska, plus 11, college pick M pick games every week and compete for prizes. This next spot I've been pondering the entire offseason. I knew we'd have this team in this spot, but didn't know it'd have a new head coach. Nebraska, the past is going gone, including the most recent rough stretch. You want to talk black shirts, let balloons fly on your first score all good with me. Just do what you must to make this a game. SVP, 3-1 when picking Nebraska last season Purdue at Syracuse, minus 1-5, 54, ET on ESPN, JMA Wireless Dome. Syracuse, New York Van Pelt's pick, Syracuse, minus 1-5, Syracuse, I took you once already this year at home. Well, let's take the orange again laying a small number to a talented Purdue outfit. SVP, 2-1 all-time when picking Syracuse South Alabama at UCLA, minus 15-5, 65, ET, Rose Bowl, Pasadena, California Van Pelt's pick, South Alabama, plus 15-5, did I tell you how much I love America last week? Did South Alabama, aka USA, repay that love with an outright road dub? Are we saying God bless the USA again? Am taking the Sun Belt and the Jaguars out in LA getting a bunch from UCLA? SVP, 2-0 all time when picking South Alabama 20 Ole Miss, minus 16-5, 63, at Georgia Tech ET on ABC, Bobby Dodd Stadium, Atlanta Van Pelt's pick, Georgia Tech, plus 16-5, ready to hold on to your butts? Because we're fixing to let's go to Atlanta where the question you get at the varsity is, what will you have? My answer, I would like the underdog Yellow Jackets not to get obliterated by Ole Miss. SVP, 4-2 all-time when picking against Ole Miss ET, Autzen Stadium, Eugene, Oregon Van Pelt's pick. Oregon, minus three, we're getting super weird now and going off script. How many Pac-12 favorites have I ever had? Can't be many, but that's all about to change. We had BYU last Saturday night earliest favorite we have ever had in this segment and they got a miracle cover over Baylor. As a thank you, M on the Ducks and Autzen. SVP, 2-0 all-time when picking Pac-12 favorites 11 Michigan State at Washington, minus three, 56-5, ET on ABC, Husky Stadium, Seattle Van Pelt's pick, Washington, minus three, same story in Seattle, this game between the Huskies and Spartans is a good one. We like UW here and are laying the points in this one as well. SVP, 9-6 all-time when picking against Michigan State 23 Pittsburgh, minus 10, 47-5, at Western Michigan ET on ESPNU, Waldo Stadium, Kalamazoo, Michigan Van Pelt's pick, Western Michigan, plus 10, finally, a team Michigan State already beat this year Western Michigan. It welcomes a Pittsburgh team that has played two wild, roller coaster games at home and now has a Mac Road game at night. Does it get weird in Kalamazoo? Do I get double digits and the Broncos at home in Waldo? Kinda have to and I will. SVP, 0-5 all time when picking against Pittsburgh, who am I kidding, I just got a little spooked and crossed it off. But if they get there you know I will claim it. 